the demolition of Penn Station was one of the biggest architectural blunders in NYC's history. In 1910, the Pennsylvania Railroad Company hired architecture firm McKim Mead and White to design the largest public space in the world. It was done in the Beaux Arts style with many design nods to classical Greek and Roman architecture. When it opened, ridership increased from 10 million in 1911 to a peak of 109 million in 1945. But operating losses started piling up after ridership started falling. So in 1963, PRR worked out a deal with Irving Felt to construct one Penn Plaza and relocate Madison Square Garden. PRR received a 25% stake in MSG and a modernized but toned down station. The public found out about the demolition plans too late, and protests by architectural preservationists proved futile. The demolition would, however, serve as the catalyst for the city's landmark laws, saving structures like Grand Central Station from a similar fate. As for the new Penn Station, art historian Vincent Scully said, one entered the city like a god, one scuttles in now like a rat, and PRR's stake in MSG ended up yielding much less than they anticipated because of a plethora of exclusions and restrictions on the revenue share. PRR eventually went bankrupt, and left the city with one of the ugliest train stations in the world.